this is Yuanli from Business Technology. In this video, I'll take you through a business rule to internet product guide. Wisnet's Zero to Internet S2D solution is a serial device server that allows you to add or integrate the Ethernet technology within the serial based product. It offers you a platform to convert the serial RS232, 485, and 422 data to Ethernet packet. Our serial converter is a hassle free solution where it requires no MCU replacement and additional firmware development. So if you want to add or embed Ethernet connectivity to a serial-based product with minimum effort, you're on the right spot. There are four main features of Wisnet Zero to Ethernet solution. First, it provides stable and reliable connection. Our unique hardwire TCP IP solution can discard unnecessary and redundant data, where it can facilitate optimal environment for transporting the data. Second, our solution provides easy configuration tools that you can retain the use of serial commands to do what you've been doing. Third, we support a virtual serial template program that you can exactly emulate the real serial ports. Lastly, including the chip, module, and external device server, we offer a broad range of interface options. So what are the sub S2E products? In a module category, we offer 1, 2, and 4 serial ports type modules. Here are the 1 port modules. Among the 1 port modules, 100SR, 105SR, and 550S2E modules are the most recent ones. They feature 3.3 voltage based TTL serial interface with an additional RS232 port on an evaluation board. It also has a MacJack enabled interface that you can add an Ethernet. Similar but not the same, 107SR gives you an option between TTL serial interface or RS232 interface, while 108SR adopts RS422 or 485 that is more suitable for longer distance communication. But if your serial device requires a DB9 port mounted RS232 interface, you can choose our 110SR that could perfectly suit your need. Two port modules. The biggest difference between one port and two port modules is in its number of ports. On 120SR board, you can add two different serial devices that is compatible with 3.3 voltage based TTL interface. But if you want to change the serial interface, you can choose to use 125SR, which is compatible with RS232 serial interface. Last modules are the 4-port modules. 140SR and 145SR both feature 3.3 voltage-based TTL serial interface. But 145SR is topped up with RJ45 Mac Jet that upon your needs, you can choose between 145SR and 140SR. If you are seeking for a more product look, you can choose our external device server. The in-case server device adds Ethernet connectivity to serial device with an RS232 port. With a talent copper option, it is RFC 2217 compliant and approved its safety and reliability with CE, FCC, and KCC marks. In contrast with the device server, our serial to Ethernet solution provides a highly integrated SOC solution. The serial to Ethernet chip W7100S2E is a compact system chip where you find a licensed networking firmware of with 107SR or with 108SR being pre installed. So far, I reviewed on our with S2E product lines.